There we go, that's the frames that I want. Hello everybody, I am a random hobo, and uh, I'm pretty sure like a month and a half back, I did a Legend of Zelda uh, Majora's Mask glitch video, it was about 35 minutes long, and uh, it, it was kinda trash quality, this one's gonna be a bit more trash quality too, but uh, once I get my setup ready, and when my birthday passes, then I'll be able to actually have a capture card for my 3DS, and it's gonna be fun, so yay! I'm happy about that. Um, but anyways, uh, today I want to emphasize on something that I'm pretty sure I didn't show. But, um, who knows, it was like a year and a half back. So, um, let's check it. Also, it, I, my room's completely bitch dark so I can get better quality. So, um, with this, uh, you want to, uh, be an Iconic Canyon. This is the Iconic Canyon, uh, triple slash clip. And, um... One of the big things is you need this specific rock um, right here that is above that safe sign, and that safe sign is going to be very important. So down here I only have my Goron mask, and uh, you only need a Goron mask and um, hookshot if you're uh, if you don't want to grab a Pona. But if you grab a Pona, then you don't need anything else other than the Goron mask. So what you do is I typically Center it about right there. Uh, no, I do not want to keep that picture. And then I crouch, pull out my sword. And uh, the way triple slash clip works is uh, you find an acute angle in the wall. You triple slash and then you put your sword away and it clips you inside of the wall. And I generally aim towards the left side of this crack right here. Um, because I get better results with that. Like that. See? That's good. Now you see I am inside of the rock. Yes. And now we want to become Big Rock Man over here. Big Rock Man, uh, he does ground pound. And he gets you on top of the rock. From here it can get a bit tricky. See? So your fairy will pop out. You want to stand right here on this crest. Do not move an inch. And whenever your fairy pops out, there you go. You check. You save, you exit, and you go back out. I'm not going to do that for this profile, because this is what I'm going to be using to show off, showcase glitches. But, um, yeah, that's how you can get into Iconic Canyon early. That's how I've seen a lot of people do it. But, um, if you guys want a little bit of a bonus, I can show you a bit. Nah, I'm good. Um, since I'm on top of this rock, there, there, there's a thing that's really neat called, um, a Goron Missile. It's a very magical thing. You take a magical picture. And as you see, I just kind of went off of the map. I did my own thing. And there I am. Oh. And I am back over here. So. Let's see if I can... No, I never memorize these guys' patterns. Why would I need to memorize these guys' patterns? Hey, what are you doing? I don't care. These guys are over here just... Ooh, ooh, ooh. I see Big Man. I see Big Rock Man. Big Rock Man's scary. But I am also Big Rock Man. But yeah. Um, let me get out of here. Ta-da! So that's how you get out of there. How you get into there is this magical trick called the Goron Missile. So first thing you want to do is get rid of you. Um, sorry for the camera angle. Oi, get this guy's attention and turn into big rock shield. Do that. Um, and then quickly, so you pull out your picta, your picta box, and you see I'm not able to use uh, my, um, my hook shot. I switch it around. It's only I'm able to use it. You take a picture, and you press A, the button that it's on, and A really quickly. And you see that hook shot is like... You can't really see it, it's blended in, but quickly get on the rock and blast. And I went off the sky, I went off the map as you can see down here. So I'm going to try to redirect. If you look on your bottom map, you can see him. And since I've launched so far into the air, I've actually got enough time to try to redirect him. However, this is very difficult, especially if you don't know the orientation of where you are going with your Goron missile. So, um... I'm just going to keep moving around for a little bit. If you if you get out of it quicker, your character will be around right here, which you just want to stay there. But also funny, I can shoot arrows with this. Boop. 
So while I'm falling to my doom, I can have fun. Oh! Okay. This is how I got it to be so weird. Okay. And he's turning that way. He's now spinning around in a circle. He He's doing a pirouette, guys. But yeah. It's, it's, this stuff is really fun. This is the stuff that fascinates me. Because <laughs> I'm just like, who, who, how were you messing around? Oh, oh, hold on. Wait. Oh, hold on. Wait, if I get him back. Can I get him back? Can I get him back? I think I can. I think I can. Get back over there. Get back over there. Yes! Holy crap! Did you see that? That was epic! No way! That was amazing! And then if you also... Uh, I'm just going to do the entire how to get it to Kana Canyon, Canyon without a poda. <laughs> just the whole shebang. Um, so right here... Um, you want to do another Goron missile. Oh, I failed it. It doesn't matter as long as I... Oh, that one I did not get a good enough picture. I did not get the magical picture. Oh, I got a magical picture. You see that hookshot bit right there? My question is, how the frick did you see me? Please, I touched the bridge. Yes! See, look, you want to touch the bridge? I touched the bridge. And then, uh, you. Screw it off. You screw off, too. I'm just trying to make sure that you guys can see it. And then from here, you just get up normally. You just took shot. And you're way up. And that is how you guys get into Akana Canyon without even a Pona. You could get in here from the very beginning of the game because you don't really have to do much to, uh, to, uh, to even get the Goron mask. All you need is Link and bombs. And if you don't have the money for bombs, you literally just grab the blast mask because that's all you need to go up into the mountains is just bombs. And everyone's like, oh no, you need the arrows. Nah, I'm going to show you guys how to get up there easily in another video. But anyway, that's going to be it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And as always, see ya.